Sundance Institute, it's mostly known for this, but it also hosts year-round labs for artists of various disciplines around the world. Most recently, the theater program packed up and shipped off to Morocco to establish an environment of creative engagement between American and Middle Eastern North African artists. Sundance sent a team to document the lab. Here's what they saw. The Sundance Theatre Labs are a program of the Sundance Institute which looks to establish environments where playwrights, directors, and other theatre makers can refine their visions for specific projects. I submitted this play to Sundance with the hope of working on it. My play was accepted and so I followed it to the Sundance Lab in Marrakesh. I think there are two kinds of artists. There are artists who write or create from what they know, and then there are those who like to escape the limits of their uh, physical bodies and imagine something else. And this year, I think particularly, there are many, many stories that come from a personal experience. In Happy New Fear, the persona in the piece is Madame Bamba. The events in Brussels happened while we were working on this. And the sad thing is, it is universal. You know, what her piece is about is happening everywhere. Yet, I'm, I'm arguing kind of like violence is individual, is experience individually. No one talked about the one in Turkey, everyone talked about the ones in Brussels. Like why suddenly you are changing your Facebook photos for the uh, Brussels flag and yet uh, you don't change your, your profile picture for the Turkish flag. There's a lot of politics, there's a lot of geopolitics, those things come up. But I think everyone understands because everyone shares this feeling that we're not our governments. We're individuals. My name is Sam Marks. I'm from New York City in the United States of America, and my project is called White Lightning. When I was in high school and after, I was in the Golden Gloves in New York City. Well, so something that happens in the world of boxing is that people are very unprecious about race, right? Like, so I was a white boxer in a ring, and I was very aware of that very early, and like, someone's Dominican, and someone is like Chinese, and someone is black, like, and you sort of identified almost by your race. It's not done with malicious intent seemingly, but of course there's like an undercurrent, right? Because of course race outside the ring can be, you know, uh, conflict-laden. So I was interested in that idea, and basically I was interested in layering that into something that was very personal. It's about three men who are, in some ways, all somewhat down and out. I'm attracted to Sam's muscular naturalism. There's a lot unsaid, as men typically don't like to uh, express their feelings a whole lot. And Sam has a really, I think, provocative way of using naturalism to suggest what's going on underneath, underneath the surface of this outwardly hyper-masculinity. What does it mean to have an American play with dealing with American racial issues and American sport in Morocco? The conscious thing is like I've been talking with people here who are not from our culture about what my play means and had to sort of distill it down to its essentials and talk about how it might cross geographic or cultural lines. I am Ammar Al Bujarat, Iraq and Jessia, Gadrat Beredi, my Karib Dasana. In 2012, I read a book by the Shah Maghribi, 
هذه اللحظة إنه أثار إنه كيف أستطيع أن أعمل عرض اسمه بوردو. I would say it's a choreographic project that looks at various aspects of things we don't want to talk about as artists, which is what bores us. أنا هربت من الدم والقتل في بغداد في العراق في بلجيكا إنه وصلت إلى بلجيكا فطلبت اللجوء فأعطوني لجوء سياسي اللجوء السياسي إنه أقدر أذهب إلى دول العالم كافة ما عدا بغداد. Each of them are looking at the idea of boredom in a different context or through a different lens. One of the great things the theater does is like we're going to all be in this room together and we're going to go through something together. To talk about violence and to talk about stereotypes and to talk about how questioning is more important than having answers actually to any of this. Mom, I want to go back to my country, and this dream will be changed, and it will be okay, there were some beautiful things here. But in the other hand, it will be in the other hand, it will be changed, 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 it will be changed.